Now, motivation is a fantastic way to kickstart any new endeavor. We've all experienced it, the initial rush of motivation that fades as we encounter any new challenges. But today now we will discuss why motivation needs a backup, a way to bridge the gap between fleeting moments or periods of motivation to keep us on track. Something that will actually guide us through the long and challenging journey to success. Now, I feel that we need discipline more than we actually need motivation. We seem to have landed in a world which is driven by instant gratification and the pursuit of quick dopamine hits. And it's discipline that often remains the unsung hero. Now, I know if I can draw on my own experience as a media production owner that I can try and provide context to the daily struggles that businesses are having with creating content and why it feels like an uphill battle and why you experience moments of motivation only to be met with longer periods where there's a lack of clarity. Even creating this video and the blog surrounding the article. It is, I've genuinely lost motivation quite a few times because life just gets in the way and it's really unforgiving and being disciplined is what actually gets me through it. So before we dive deeper, let's address the misconception surrounding discipline. It is often associated with punishment in our childhood memories. If you did something wrong, then it would be discipline that would be used to correct the bad behavior. Now, discipline is unfairly gained a negative connotation over time. But the truth is, discipline is not a tool for punishment. It is a force for transformation and achievement. It's the steady hand that guides us towards our goals and our unwavering commitment to personal and professional growth and self-improvement. So I want you to consider some of the scenarios that you might resonate with. You could be a small business owner, excited to grow your business, but you are struggling to maintain content creation because of your duties. You could be a solo entrepreneur who is overwhelmed by the demands of your growing client base. You could also be a full-time employee and aspiring author who's passionate about sharing their journey, but you're struggling with the, the job's demands. You could be a working parent and a fitness enthusiast and you are finding a challenge to balance your responsibilities. Now, in each of these scenarios, motivation, while it's valuable, it's also a fleeting emotion. It's like the spark that ignites a fire to start your goal. But motivation requires a constant fueling and relies, well, relies heavily on your emotional state. Motivation can drive us to start a project or pursue a goal. It is often diminished when it is faced with adversity or the monotony of long-term efforts. And we've all been there. We get fired up to make something succeed and slowly over time it gets chipped away. Motivation now needs support, an underlying foundation to back up when motivation itself has been lost. Now, in today's world of instant gratification, we are accustomed to quick fixes and immediate results, and discipline often takes a backseat. But let's, you know, let's consider the realities of the digital landscape. With over 140 million active YouTube channels in 2023, only a fraction of those have amassed over 100,000 subscribers. So, Reliance solely on motivation to trace subscriber numbers will, will eventually lead to burnout and it's going to lead to disappointment. 
So you may ask, well, what's the point? Why bother when so many people are failing? But it's important that we understand the numbers and who they are serving. Now, whilst the numbers not may not be vast, they might be reaching a small collective of people who really find value in your content. So don't rely on the numbers. Instead, we need to focus on creating content that truly matters to your audience. It's about quality over quantity and the meaningful connections you forge with your viewers. Remember, your impact extends far beyond the subscriber numbers. So now let's apply the concept of discipline to business and content creation. It's about adhering to a strategic plan, consistently working on marketing, customer service and product development, even when the initial excitement wanes. This discipline separates thriving businesses from those that fizzle out. So let's redefine discipline. It's not about punishment, it's about self-mastery. It's about the unwavering commitment to personal and professional growth and the determination to persist when motivation falters. Being disciplined is also a change of mindset. It helps shape how we think about certain stigmas. I used to feel you know, suffocated about posting content daily having to think about new ideas daily and I, I generally got content fatigue and the message became watered down. Now posting daily is not bad advice, in fact it has excellent merit, but I think how we post daily requires a rethink. I myself have taken a seat back or a back seat and I am focusing on one good idea at a time and really fleshing that idea out into a blog article and then you know a video that complements each other and i'm using those pieces of content to then split and distribute daily now initially this was a great motivator but the reality and responsibility of life soon kicked in and it quickly faded so to keep this going i needed to be disciplined now this change to flesh out one idea to make it great and to take a step back, it actually helped my mental health. I know that even with this help, the motivation will rise and fall. So I need a constant baseline and it's discipline that helps me get through that. So the next time you embark on a new venture or face a challenging project, remember that motivation is just the spark and discipline is the fire that will keep it burning, even in the face of adversity. Now, I'm not advocating that discipline is easy. In fact, it's bloody hard and I'm certainly no stranger to the feeling of packing it all in but I have a journey that I want to walk the line on and I can see the end goal in my mind, but I know motivation is not the only answer. So if you like this content, please give me the thumbs up. Please share any comments you have and until next time, cheers.